We are at Destination Salem now with uh, Destination Salem Director Kate Fox. She's the Executive Director. Kate, it's been a long time since I've been here, so I know I was just talking with Mayor, um, Mayor Driscoll downstairs, and there's always a lot going on. You guys just had a, a poetry festival. What was that about? Right, the Mass Poetry Festival returned to Salem this year for the fifth time. Um, I'm sorry, fourth time in Salem, fifth time for the festival, and they were here over the weekend and had a great turnout of poets and poetry enthusiasts. So where, 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 where were some of the venues? Uh, they worked with the Peabody Essex Museum, and then they work in restaurants. They do slams in different restaurants around town. Slam? And poetry slams, okay. which is um, competitive open mic poetry. Oh, uh, and they do um, they did uh, programming at the Peabody Essex Museum, different hotels, and the uh, maritime site, and these churches as well for some wow, of their cool. receptions. All right, so now there's always something going on. Always. Um, we're heading toward uh, the middle of, of spring now, so what's up next for Salem? Uh, coming up next, May get, starts to get busy, and we have the Salem Ferry to Boston opening May 23rd. The ferry season starts and goes through Halloween. And uh, so that goes from Blaney Street, which has been completely redeveloped down mm -hmm. uh, the wharf there and into Long Wharf next to the aquarium. They are offering a discount this year for uh, Salem residents. So make sure to take your Salem ID if you're a resident and go down to ride the ferry. Where does the ferry go? Uh, so it's uh, 55 minutes on the high-speed catamaran from mm -hmm. Blaney Street to Long Wharf in Boston. Okay. Okay, now some of the other activities coming up, let's say between now and, uh, I don't know, maybe June 1st or so. Uh, first Fridays is, well, it's after June 1st because we just had our May 1st Friday, but the first Friday of every month, Salem uh, celebrates the arts and culture scene with programming, uh, dance recitals, concerts, uh, lots of things going on throughout the downtown, and that information can be found on Facebook and also on SalemFirstFriday.com. Salem and Friday. I okay. always invite people to come to Salem.org, which is the Destination Salem website. We have a, a, web, a calendar online that we update constantly and try to make that the go-to resource for what's happening in Salem. Okay, and if anybody wants to give you a call or visit the headquarters, what do they do? We are, uh, you can give us a call at 978-741-3252, and Destination Salem is located on uh, uh, in City Hall on the third floor. If people are looking for visitor resources, we do recommend that they go to the Visitor Center, though, and the National Park Rangers at 1 New Liberty Street are happy to, I'm sorry, 2 New Liberty Street are happy to help. All right. uh, the other thing to say is this weekend, um, this Saturday, which is May, May 11th, the Berkeley uh, Summer Series of Free Jazz in Derby Square starts, so that's a another opportunity to celebrate the arts and culture scene. And what are some of the things that go on there? So that is a concert, it's a free concert on Derby Square, which is on Front Street behind Old Town Hall, and it's um, just an opportunity to enjoy some great music, and they do it uh, periodically throughout the summer, leading up to the Salem Jazz and Soul Festival in August. Excellent. I remember some polka festivals going on over there a, a long time ago. So I, No more polka. <laughs> no. <laughs> I know. That was the old, uh, never mind. <laughs> All right, Kate, anything else you want to mention before we go? A lot of new restaurants on the horizon in Salem, so maybe oh, really? next time we can we can talk about those. Yeah. Some openings coming, uh, and uh, so we'll be able to share those. But the restaurant scene is booming, and it's it's summer. All right. Good time to see Salem. Kate Fox, Destination Salem, with more stuff online. I'm Rex Moore.